So right now, this is going to be a very special meeting for all of us, especially with my with our business partners here in Europe, because SRM Eri Jong will be sharing us everything we need to know about Himogen. So Eri, uh, if you're ready, I will give you the host. Yeah, a big round of loss for Ari. Hi, and thank you everyone for inviting me to your meeting. And I think I won't be able to go everything, all the detail, all about Hemohem, because as you know, Hemohem is the one flat on the the flagship product of Atomy, and it takes time for us to understand. So don't try to understand everything about Hemohem today. I'll ask our Joyce to invite me one more time to go over Hemohem because there are so many things that we need to um, know. So stay tuned for another session for Hemohem. So I'll try to cover most of stuff that I know and the stuff, the things, things that you should know. To, so something you, you will be useful for you to share when you are meeting prospects or consumers who are interested in Hemohim. So as you'll know, Hemohim, um, I just mentioned that Hemohim is a, one of the flagship product of Atomy. And the reason that Atomy can be global and so many consumers around the globe are falling in love with Atomy, one reason besides skincare, it's a Hemohim. So Hemohim has been sent, Hemohim has been selling for the last 11 years. And because of that, Atomy came up with you know, different marketing system. So they call it like um, Infogram. So they came up with a certain, so I know it's in, only in Korean. So that's why I try to translate it in English, which I have posted already on, uh, on my Atomy Facebook. So when you look at this infogram here, they try to put the keywords. So I think this keyword also can help you, right? Also can help you to memorize it so in order for you to explain him or him. If you understand the keyword, this will help you to share him or him. So I'm just going to quickly go over. Um, and if you need a slide, uh, there's no no issue. Um, I, I can just forward the slides to our just and I just can share, share it to the group later on. So uh, when you look at the circle over here, there are all the keywords, which I just translated to English. Eight years of research, immune system, CARI. So as you'll know, CARI stands for Korean Atomic Energy Research Institute. And some people say, oh, it's hard to memorize it. And I made a joke. Okay, if you know... My name is Ari, and you know I'm Korean, so Korean Ari. So easy to memorize it. So Kerry, and the first time in Korea, and it's a bestseller, and it, it has been TV, uh, it has been commercialized and in TV too, and it also selling in 16 countries and four rounds of the earth. Probably you will not know what it means, but I will show you another slides which will explain four rounds of the earth and this is an individually recognized product and in one box it has a 60 chassis inside and for seven consecutive years Hemoy has been a number one health supplement selling in korea so not only in atomy in the marketing company there are so many companies that are selling health supplement but Hemoy has been the number one for last um, last seven consecutive years. And Hemohim definitely used advanced technology and Angelica Radix and Sinidim Officinel is one of the ingredients of Hemohim. So let me just go into the details of Hemohim. So as you'll know, Hemohim, it's very different from many of the supplements which you will find from organic stores or the drug stores. Because Hemohim, it's not a medicine, it's a health supplement. That's why, anybody have a medical license? If you do have a medical license, yes, you can, you can share him or him if it's, if it's considered as a medicine. But a person like me who doesn't have a medical license, I can even share, this is a key point, even the person I see on the street, stranger, I can still share him or him. The big difference here is him or him is considered as a natural health supplement. And the reason I fell in love with Atomy and the reason I got involved with, um, involved with Atomy, definitely I saw the miracle happen in my body with Hemohim. And I can share a little bit of my experience with Hemohim a bit later on after I go over about Hemohim. So how Hemohim was created, once you understand that whole story, you will know this product is very different from any health supplement which you are selling in a retail store. So number you number um, number eight, you see on the screen what it means. As you know, 
like I mentioned, Hemohim is not invented or created for the consumers like us. The main intention for Hemohim was for the scientists working at CARI. So I mentioned about the CARI, which is Korean Atomic Energy Research Institute. And I'm sure you have seen the slide like this many times during our uh, one-day seminars or ATMI intro seminars. So if you understand how ATMI's majority of the products are manufactured, you will be helping you to understand the bit of Hemohim also. So CARI, was the one who created Hemohim and it took eight years. And it was not intended for the general public like us, general public, or which means like general Korean citizens. It was made for the, only for the scientists working in Kerry. So if you take a time tonight or a bit later on, if you search about the Korean Atomic Energy Research Institute, it's not just ordinary laboratory, it's a Korean government funded institution where they're really hire top-notch scientists. And you know, the technology which they are using, it's they're they are dealing with the radiations, gamma rays, all, all the sorts of um, like energies there. So they need something to boost or protect their immune systems. So you can see the number here. The Korean government funded $50 million. So think about all those pharmaceutical companies, what are, why or what are they doing? They're spending fortunes, research and development. But in order for Hemoin to be created, gov Korean government funded 50, um, 5 million US dollars. So with that 5 million dollars funded by the Korean government, it took total eight, eight years of research. So from the eight years of research, five years of you know, finding ingredients, trying out. So if you ask how many ingredients did they have actually tried it out? According to the scientist who was really part of this project, I'll show you the picture later. He said thousand different types of herbals, fruits and vegetables. Out of all that, they were able to come up with the three ingredients, which I'll show you this, the three pictures a bit later on. So from the eight years, five years of intensive research, and later what they did, they also tested in a cancer hospital. So this product has, this natural health supplement, Hemohim has been tested already to the cancer patient in Korea. So there's a cancer hospital in Korea, so it was tested for the patients there. Okay, so this is Dr. Byung Myung Woo, and he's not only famous in Korea, he is, um, he, if you search for the top scientists in the world, he's always one of the scientists. They always pick a, um, top 100 scientists in the world, and his name is always there. So Dr. Byung Myung Woo, he's really behind of creating um, this Hemohim and our skincare set. So the skincare set that you have seen it on the Atom UK website, it's a fame or absolute skincare set. But even before that, Atomy has introduced Atomy six skincare set. So Dr. Byung Myung Woo, he is behind of creating Hemohim and six skincare set. And when we're talking about Hemohim, we cannot really compare with any of the health supplement which will boost the immune system in a retail market. Starting, starting, the creation of this product itself is different. The technology which they have been used is totally different. The carry. What technology do they have it? They have a technology to create a space boot. And if you search for the names of the countries or numbers of the countries which they can manufacture a space boot, I don't know how many, uh, how many number of world um, countries in the world, uh, maybe like 300, I haven't really counted. So, but let's say we have more than 300 countries in the world. Out of all those countries, there are only three countries have uh, technology to create a space food. And Korea is one of those countries. So Korea, Russia, and USA, is only three countries has a technology to create a space food. So with that special technology, the Hemoy was created. And when we had a first astronaut um, in Korea, 2008, and when she going up, um, you know, up to the space, she needs to pick a space, special food. They're not gonna bring a pizza or anything that we are eating on earth. So I think um, from what he explained, they had a granola bar and on the, um, on the granola bar, he added a hemohim there too. So this astronaut went upstairs, uh, went up to the space with the hemohim granola bar. So, 
And just tell you one on one story, which I heard from from one of the one of the consumer here. When I started at me um, a year later, I, I had to go like like five hour five um, hours away from where I live, and I have to explain about him or him. There's a one gentleman, white uh, white gentleman. Um, not really listening to my lectures. I mean, he was he was a big skeptical in my lectures, and he his arm was crossed. But when I was talking about him, him, I mentioned about Kerry, and I mentioned about the technology which they have. And after explaining about that part, he was the first gentleman who said, "Oh, I want to give it a try on this product." And he said, Eric, I have been working in a pharmaceutical company, well-known pharmaceutical company in Canada for last thirty years." So when you say you, you're going to introduce a natural health supplement, oh, I said, okay, so tell me about it because I'm the expert in the area. But as soon as you told me that you came up from Kerry, which they have a technology to create a space boot, no doubt. I have zero doubt of trying him or him. I don't have to know the ingredient, just my knowing the technology, the level of technology which Kerry has, I have no problem trying out him or him. And he's, he's still a consumer of Atomy. When Hemohim was first created it, it was only in 30 trishe in a one box. And it wasn't selling through Atomy, it wasn't selling directly to the retail market. Right? Because as I mentioned, Hemohim was created not for Atomy, Hemohim was created for the scientists. And when they tested in a cancer hospital, they found it out, oh, it's going to help many people who are suffering, who has illnesses. So they decided to make it public. But you know, scientists, they don't really, they're not really good with the numbers. They're not really, they don't really have a background with the marketing. So they didn't know what is a market price. They didn't know where to really sell it. So when they were selling it, this box, they were selling it for $700. Imagine how, how many people can afford this box for that $700. Doesn't matter how good it is, how many citizens in Korea can afford a $700 box. So, the carry, when they start introducing him or him to the public, yes, people who can afford, they were able to buy one or two boxes, but it didn't last long. And long story short, that's where CEO Hangul Park comes in. And when he joined, it became 48 and 54 and 60 shashi. So now when we are purchasing him with boxes, we have a total 60 packs in a box. Even when I joined Atomy, when I first got my Hemoin box, it was only 54 shashi. And it was $700, but by CEO Hangin Park getting involved by distributing Hemoin, and he was able to reduce the price, and it has been the same price ever since CEO Hangin Park opened up, opened up Atomy. And with no price change, CEO Hangin Park was able to increase to 60 shashi. So I cannot really go in detail like how he was able to increase 60. I'll go more in detail next time when we do have another Hemohim session. So Hemohim is an individually recognized health food ingredient and that can improve immune function. So if somebody asks you, what is a Hemohim? What is a Hemohim good for? Without any really medical background, you cannot really go in detail, but you can just say Hemohim will boost your immune system and it help you with modulation. And when I introduce a Hemohim, some people who knows that I'm Korean, they also ask, okay, so you think that Hemohim can boost the immune system, but I have been taking red ginseng. I just put that picture here, red ginseng or Hong Sam Dam. I've been taking that too. And I also know that it is also good for the immune system. Why are you telling me the Hemohim was able to get patents, right? It was able to get patents around the globe, but Hong Sam Dan or Red Sinsing doesn't have any patents. Only difference, Hong Sam Dan, it's from the nature. Nobody invented it. It's just that our ancestors found this amazing, right? Amazing root. It's a root. They found it and they figured it out. Okay, so if we grow for four to six years, we'll be able to get a lot of ginsenoside. We'll be able to get a lot of beneficial or benefit from this Hong Sam Dan. So nobody invented this red ginseng. So there is no patents available for the red ginseng, but why there are a lot of patents available and many people are looking for it because this is man-made. 
This, this is a substance which never exists in the world, but Kerry is the first one who came up with it. That's why it needs to get a number of patents. And it has, I will also show you the screen, I think the next one, it has a number of patents in Korea and it already got it in Europe. Even when I joined Atomy, when I, it was already there. So when Hemohim was invented, they already have, they acquired the patents from all those countries already. And all from this, I mean, from this chart, what we're focusing on is how hemohim can help. So four main areas, improving anti-cancer activity, immune response and hematopoiesis of the body and protecting the body from oxidative damage. So as I mentioned, hemohim has been tested to the cancer patients, to the cancer patients in cancer hospital in Korea. And when I look at the research document, they tested to the, I believe like a 13th, ladies in a one unit, which they have ovary cancer, um, ovary cancer or stomach cancers. So they have a specific, um, specific cases, which they have tested for um, with the hemohem. And what they have noticed it, they noticed that all the side effect comes with the radiation therapy or chemotherapy has been reduced dramatically. So if you have talked to the person who suffer from a chemo, um, suffer from a cancer and when they go through radiation or chemotherapy you know what side effect they're going through usually like discoloration of their nails or the skin or lose appetite i think that's a number one thing they lose appetite and since they lose appetite they won't be able to eat much so it um, it decrease their energy too and the lose the hair so there are so many things comes with the side effect of radiation therapy and chemotherapy, but what they have noticed is when they start giving hemohim to those patients, they notice that the side effect dramatically reduces. That's why uh, even myself, I don't know anything about right the cancer, like what what they have to go through the radiation chemotherapy, but I can still introduce hemohim because it has been tested and it has been proved. But one thing we're not we're not gonna say it's 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 gonna cure cancer. We're not guaranteeing anything, but we can say it will improve. Um, it will help them to go through their radiation or chemotherapies. And when you when you talk to pe uh, people who has been taking hemohim for like more than like two years, you will also hear them not only helping them with their um, their energy levels or their I mean some of the issues they have. Not only that, it also helped them to stay younger. So I, I have seen um, some of the ladies who are over 65 and who has been taking for, I mean, longer than five years. When I look at them, um, even beside them, they're not using absolute skincare set. I can see them. Um, they're aging process has been delayed. I can see, I can still see their skin is firm and all that. They all said, oh, it has been changed ever since I started taking and continuously taking Hemohim. And this one, you'll be able to find like some of the global branches and you'll be able to find this one in, in the, um, you know, Google too. Many people has uploaded. And if some people are asking you, okay, I want to search Hemohim information on my own. What I usually do, I just copy this number and I give it to them. Because when for, for, uh, for my USA member, when I give this US uh, um, 0696-4785 number, when she just type in the number on a Google, she'll be able to find that information on the website. So I, I try my best to share the accurate information to my consumers or my prospect, but sometimes they want to cross check the information. They want to get the information on their own. Then we can always share this number and then let them do their own research about Hemohem. So as I mentioned, um, in order for Hemohem to be created, it, for five years, what they have been doing, they tested different types of different number of ingredients. Imagine, yes, for us each to say thousand ingredients, but what they did, they mixed 10 ingredients together, like eight ingredients together. So they did everything possible to come up with best supplement, right? Best natural supplement, which will boost the immune system and protect immune system. Because what the scientist has believed that once a person has a strong, or stable immune system, they are pretty much okay. They'll be able to fight over anything coming into their body. But out of all that, they pick this three main ingredients. And if you, if it's hard for you to see all the different benefits, you can get it from this um, individual 
supplements. I can also um, send you the screenshot of it. So Angelica Radix and Medium of Fishnel and Peony Peonia Japonica. When you look at individuals, herbal benefits, how they are beneficial, you'll be amazed because when, when people are taking him or him, they sometimes said, oh, my menstrual cramp has been improved and my eczema skin has been improved. So you will see all different types of the symptoms which can be treated, right? Which they can see a better result with him or him. So even Angelica Radix, um, Nidium officinale and Peonia Japonica, it's not rare. It's something you'll be able to get it. If you just Google it, you will be, you can actually get a herb from Amazon, or if you know any Chinese or herbal doctors, you'll be able to get it from them. But why do we need hemohim? Because as I mentioned, hemohim is something that met made and it has been created with a top notch, right? Top grade technology. If we get those three ingredients, if we boil it at home, what will have it? We'll be able to drink it, but we won't be able to drink it for long. The reason it still has a toxins in it. Um, if you haven't taken Chinese medicine before, because for me growing up in Korea, uh, my mom, the, two times a year, my mom usually get a Chinese medicine and then ask me to drink it um, to protect um, to protect myself, um, to like stay healthy during the winter time. I, I can't not drink longer than three weeks because if I drink longer than three weeks, my liver won't be able to tolerate the toxins. So there's a certain time that we can't take herbal medicine, but him or him, it's main ingredients are herbal, but we'll be able to take this him or him for year long. I've been taking for the last seven years without stopping it. And sometimes I'm not taking just only one or two, I'm taking up to six, but still, no problem. It only doing all the good things for me. The reason, as I mentioned, with the amazing technology, they got all the beneficial ingredients from this three, eliminate all the toxins. I'm just going to show this slide first. So when you look at this USFD chart, you will see, I just put the like red highlight here. You will, this is all the names of the chemicals. Nothing detected. When they run through hemohim through their machine to find any toxicity, because if hemohim has even 0.01% of toxicity, you will be considered as a medicine, which means the person like me who doesn't have a medical license are not allowed to sell this product. But hemohim is just selling officially on our website. Everybody can share it, everybody can buy it because they weren't able to detect any of the toxins from the hemohim. So, which means this one considered as a natural health supplement. So I'm just introducing a new types of, you know, broccoli or new types of blueberry juice to the people who doesn't know him or him. So this one, you will be able to, you can also find this picture. It's not only me, um, got, got access to this file. You can also find this one because him or him information, it's officially uploaded on the website. So when you look at, when you look at, Oh. When you look at the, the benefit of hemohim, when you take hemohim in the big, the broad terms, it will boost, protect our immune system, and it helps to modulate it. When you go to our Atomy website, you will see hemohim will help us to increase the number of NK cells. And during pandemic, probably the, the, the word NK, NK cells, I'm being familiar to you. So people who have a lot of NK cells getting less Right, getting protected by the virus and people who has a less NK cells, more, right, more, of a, more chance of getting virus. So what this NK cells? Um, NK cells stands for natural killer cells in our bone marrow. But by taking hemohim, look at how many NK cells will be in your body. So if this was taking before taking hemohim, but by take. Uh, by taking hemohim, number of NK cells will be increased. So imagine so you have so many NK cells running around in your body. Anything that comes in your body, this NK cell go and attack it. I was able to find um, some of the picture, how the NK cell looks like. You know that um, there's a game called Pac-Man? Actually, this NK cell looks like a Pac-Man. So when there is a virus coming into the body, what this NK cell will do? NK cells go and eat those, all those viruses coming in. 
So imagine more by taking hemohim, it will increase the number of NK cells. Of course, you're getting less sick. Um, even the problem that you had, you know that you will be cured or you will be, um, you, you know that it got better in just in a short time. And, and this is one slide shows that by taking hemohim, it will increase the days of increasing white blood cells. Because when I was talking to the person who went, really went through the chemotherapy, um, um, cancer and who went through the radiation and, and chemotherapy, in order for them to go for uh, next chemotherapy, the doctors usually what they're checking, they're checking their white blood, um, white blood cells, number of white blood cells. If it's not up to a certain level, even if they are scheduled for the next, um, next therapy, they won't be able to go for it by Taking him or him, what we'll do, you will speed track, right? It will speed track the number of, increase the number of white blood cells. So the person who needs to go for the therapy, they will be able to get the session on the day they want it. Because most of the times when, when the person diagnosed with the cancer, doctor will tell you, you need to go through that, you know, 10 radiation, like a 10 chemotherapy. But most of the time people really can't not complete it because people usually get tired already after one or two sessions of chemo or radiation therapy. But what is a hemohim? As I mentioned, hemohim, it's not going to cure cancer, but it will help. It will help the persons to go through the whole session of radiation or chemotherapy. So it will help, help to fight over cancer. And this is just a um, screen capture of some of the information. So as I mentioned, hemohim has been tested, right? Tested in, um, in carry. And there are so many different areas where hemohim has been tested. Hemohim has been tested for the, uh, the people with a diabetes or gastric problem. So when you want to know a little bit more about hemohim, I think it's better for you to do a little bit more research on your own too. On your free time, um, if you don't have any special thing to read, just click hemohim. Um, or you can click NIH hemohim. Then you will find all those informations and you don't have to read through the whole thing. Sometimes I get lost too because they, they do have a lot of um, scientists the word in there, but when you just look at the abstract and what tests they have been done it, you will know how hemohim really can help people with the many different uh, issues. So I showed this already. Okay, so when we share hemohim, I said we can share hemohim to anybody that we know, except a person who has a organ transplant. So I'll just mention the uh, what word. So you can basically share hemohim to everybody that you know, except the person who has an organ transplant. So if when you are sharing to a uh, hemohim, instead of just sharing, it's always best to hear the issues they're having or the conditions they are into. If the person says, oh, I just had a surgery, always ask. Instead of, just, oh, hemohim, it's good for you. Instead, just ask what types of surgery they had. If it's just like leg surgery or hip surgery, they just had a surgery somewhere, okay, it's okay for to share him or him. It will definitely improve the healing process. However, if the person says, oh, I had a, the organ transplant, so that's the one person that you won't be able to share him or him because the person who had an organ transplant, they have to take an antidepressant, but by taking him or him, you will, um, you will boost them the person's own immune system, so it will reject the new organ transplant, transplant to the person's body. So that's one thing that we just have to be careful. So when we're sharing him or him, just double check with the, the person where we are sharing him or him with their conditions. The one that you're seeing on the screen, um, there is also a file for this one. So if you want it, I will send you the whole copy for it. Not everyone. Um, personally, I didn't have any healing crisis. But when you share hemohim, sometimes you might hear some people say, oh, I start taking hemohim, but I start having a diarrhea. Oh, I start taking hemohim, but all of a sudden I had a constipation. I start vomiting. You don't need to worry. We, what we call it is a healing crisis. So person who already had a condition, who has a problem in their stomach or a person who has a, a problem in their liver, if the, or, they already had a problem in their organs by taking hemohim, hemohim is reacting to it. So this is not a bad sign. It's a healing crisis. So while hemohim is adjusting to a body, it will show as one or two symptoms. So something you don't need to worry, you can also forward this file to the member and you can always 
for that, you know, US FDA, nothing detected, there is no toxicity. So when people see that, I mean, they usually their anxiety of getting reactions with hemohim will come down. So, so I had a one lady, um, she's 85 years old. I think there was uh, the first, um, the first scary moment that I had with the hemohim. So uh, when I went to the one house party, there was a one lady, she said, Oh, I really want to try hemohim. And she said, I I'm taking daily, I am taking like a 10 to 15 different types of the medications. So which means like her body, it's not, not well. So when I ask, cause she has a diabetes, she has a cholesterol. So she's taking 10, um, 10 to like 15 different number of pills. And when I mentioned, I really want to give it a try. So she, she purchased the one box and just a couple of days later, I'm start receiving a phone call from her. And she said, it's good that I'm staying at home, but diarrhea doesn't stop. And you know how long it lasted for her around 10 days. And it was really a moment that she was going to sue me. <laughs> she goes to sue at me Canada for her going through diarrhea. But for me, I had an amazing result with Hemohim. And I did a lot of research about Hemohim. So I was, I was really 100% confident that Hemohim won't do any damage for her body. And I, I saw this healing crisis even before introducing Hemohim. So I told her, trust me. And can you just continue? Can you complete at least two weeks? And the miracle really happened. So 10 days for loss of diarrhea. On the 12th day, she said, it stopped. And when she wake up in the morning, she said, the tiredness she used to have in her body has been disappeared. So yes, um, she was a very scary old lady for um, 10 days when she was calling me. But after that, She's loving me for introducing him to him. And when I called back her like a couple of months later, when she had a checkup with the doctor, doctor said she can reduce one of the cholesterol pills. So not everyone, but I have noticed that some of the ladies or some of the seniors who are taking a lot of medications, but by taking, adding him or him to their um, daily, daily diet, they are reducing one or two. Yeah, one or two medications, which they've been taking for many years. So there are like the common questions that I usually get. I know like we will also have a question and answer session, but common question that I usually get from consumers, how many shastays should I take per day? So when you get a box of a hemohim, um, it will say you need to take two per day. So that's what's recommended. There are some people, yes, um, hemohim, it's not, it's not really low price health supplement. So there are some people who really cannot afford one. So they are taking like, you know, one a day so they can make it two or two months. But to me, I said it's better than better than not taking it. And I know of one couple, they cannot really afford to buy two boxes of Hemohim. So what they're doing, they buy one box, each couple taking one sachet a day. But to them, it's better than not taking it. It's compared to the time when they're not taking it, when they wake up in the morning or during the time they usually catch a cold, they say it's way much better. So how many should I say should I take per day? Two is a really minimum. And if you want to take more, because um, when, when pandemic started, I start taking more, like four to six. But I recommend not to take more than six because according to Dr. Byung Byung who created him or him, he said six is the maximum that our body meat. Even if you're taking 12 or even if you're taking 10, our body's already in the maximum immune level, right? So even if you're taking eight or six, it's the same result as when you're taking six. So if you want to maximize the number of hemohim you are taking, six, right? I remember when CEO Hunger Park was here in Canada for the Success Academy, I believe like 2016, I saw him, I saw him taking him away. He was really taking like 10 for the whole day, but he's a CEO of Edsomy and I know he has a health issue so he can take 10. So two to six a day. And the person who has a cancer, we usually suggest them to take the six. So a person came two to two and daily you can take two but you know, sometimes you know that you're coming down with a cold. I mean, last week I, I had a symptom of like, you know, runny nose. I took six a day. So, but it, I, not really a sickness. Um, the, the low days, it didn't last for a whole week. Only a couple of days I was able to get better. Okay. So will the question you'll be getting from people is like, will it cure, you know, arthritis, will it cure cancer, will it cure this? It's not, it's not going to cure. It's like health supplements. It will help. 
Hamohi will help us to have a quality life, but it's not going to cure any of the disease or any of the symptoms. Thing. You will help us help our immune system to get strong. So we'll be able to fight over any of the issues that we have. And can children take this hemohim? Um, answer for this one. When you, I, I believe like when you look at the box of a hemohim, especially in Canada, to, um, over six, right? The children over 60 years old, they will be able to take hemohim. And the reason the six, this is an explanation from uh, Dr. Byung Byung Woo, who created a hemohim. From the, from the baby, when it was born until six, they need to develop their own immune system, own, own, like, own, uh, own immune protecting like, mechanisms. But by interfering with other immune boosting supplements, they won't, be have, they won't be able to have their own um, fighting mechanism. So probably that's a, that's a reason. After six, yes, you can introduce hemohim. But for my case, since I believe in hemohim, I have no problem feeding my children hemohim for their rest, rest of life. I've been feeding hemohim to my girls when they were like three and four. I, I believe like a two and three. So I had no problem uh, by sharing. And, you know, really not going to, but compared to any um, any children in that age they have they have been catching they have been catching like less cold um less times of getting any you know like any like runny nose um, runny noses and i also get a question from people is it okay to purchase a hemohim at other online shopping mall like you know amazon or any other like lazada because area when i get uh, when i go to add to me online shopping mall and when i go to other online shopping mall i'll be able to get you know one or two dollar cheaper one thing I tell them, that's your choice, but I cannot tell the authenticity of Hemohim. I cannot tell it's real Hemohim or not. I also heard, and Tio Hong Kipar also mentioned during one of, um, one, of one, one of the one day seminar four years ago that he found fake Hemohim selling already. So, which means the, the fame of Hemohim, it's, you know, once the once one certain product get popular, what happened? People's trying to make fake products and trying to make money out of it. So, Hemohim was one of that product. So, there are people who are make fake Hemohims. So, unless you buy from official Atsumi online shopping mall, we cannot guarantee. So, I usually tell them, I mean, that is your choice, right? In order for you to save one or two dollars, if you want to go that risk, still fine but if i were you i will still purchase from official website where i can still complain if there is any problem which i can still exchange um return the product product if there is any problem with the product and because of him with him it um atomy have atomy could become a two billion dollar company and this is just to show how many Hemohim has been. So Hemohim export $3 million and Jinseng export 240. So you can see, you can see how amazing Hemohim it is. And this one shows that. So remember, I, I was explaining about the four laps of the earth, four rounds of the earth. So if you line up the Hemohim so, so far, it's, this is a total kilometers and it laps the, the earth for the four times. And I think this is fun. Sometimes I share this one for fun and people say, wow, it's selling that fast, that much. Seven shashi per second and 438 boxes per hour. That's how much a Hemohim sell, um, Hemohim boxes are selling per day. Okay, so imagine 400, uh, 438 boxes per hour times 24. So Atom is running 24 hours. So imagine how many boxes are being sold in a one day. And Hemohim, um, 12 years Accumulate sales of 1.3 billion packs already. And I'm just going to show you. So I was able to get, uh, oh, it's not, it doesn't show. Let me try to, oh, it's not showing that much. Okay, so I was able to get this Hemohim, um, Hemohim magazine. And unfortunately, it's only in um, Korean. And inside, inside of here, they had a little bit more history and all the story which I have shared today. Um, it's in here in a cartoon. So I'm, I'm hoping that actually also coming come up with the English version I think this is one of the book you can carry it's not that thick you can carry easily and whoever asking you Hemohim will be able to um, share easily or you can just show the cartoon that people usually don't read the novels or like articles but they love to read what's on the cartoons okay okay so there are more informations that I could share but 
even I, I think I went over like 20 minutes. <laughs> Because when it comes to him or him, yes, it, it could be simple. But when you try to go in details, there are plenty of information. Okay, so I'll try to stop here. If you have any questions, um, you're more than welcome to ask. Thank you very much, Eri. Thank you very much for all the lovely, lovely inf information. I can really use that um, when we are introducing him or him here, because a lot of people are really very curious on what the effects are of him or him in their bodies. And this is really a very good information for us. However, uh, I have some questions uh, with him because we have experienced this with a lot of members. So the first question, Eri, is um, there are some members who are feeling very sleepy after taking him with him. So is this also part of the healing um, crisis yes. that you are telling? Yes. Um, I'm hearing that a lot from many, many people that I have shared him with him. So um, let me just open up the healing crisis. What are the, what's there? Okay, I'm going to show you this. Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. But... So when you look at over here, so there's a two pages, but I'm only showing the first one, but it also has like, you know, sense of helplessness. It also feeling like really um, like extremely tired when you have a blood circulation disorder, right? Because you know, person who has a um, blood circulation disorder or blood circulation issues, something it will not really show, but once they start showing some of the issues here and they even here, um, when when the person has a problem in the liver, fatigue, drowsiness. Okay, perfect. So um, thank you very much for that information, Eric. This is really important for us, especially that some of the members, really like almost all of the members who have tried him with him experience the same. So this is a very good um, answer to that. So everyone, this is part of the healing crisis and it will be over um, by taking him with him like after 10 days or 12 days, as according to Eri, with the sharing about, the, about her member that was, uh, I think, 85 years old at the time. Yes. Um, Eri, second question is, you mentioned a while ago that hemohim is not good for people who had organ transplant. Mm -hmm. And is it also not good for people that has allergies with celery because it has this ingredient? Or uh, no. can so, you clear that for us? Yeah. Even the member, I have a member who has an allergy with the peanuts. And I have a person with an allergy with the berries, you know, strawberries, or blueberries. They are taking hemohim to get rid of the allergy. So as I mentioned, hemohim is boosting your immune system and another function is modulating. So um, I, I forgot to share my, uh, my experience. The reason I fell in love with the hemohim, the reason I say, oh, it really gave me the miracle effect because I had a seasonal, seasonal allergy. I think like UK, they call it hay fever. I had it for like last eight years. So um, every spring, every fall, whenever there's a season change, I have like serious allergy issues. And for two weeks, I have a runny nose. You know, people who has an allergy like probably will agree the symptoms that I that I had. But once I once I take it hemohim, of course, I didn't see the effect right away because I start taking it winter time. There's no allergy. So I've been taking every day. And then when next spring fall on when, ne um, when next spring hits, I didn't see any symptoms. There's no symptom for like no body ache, no runny nose, I mean, no itchy eyes. And then on the same year, winter came, no allergy. So I, I was amazed because my doctor, home doctor told me that, because I always ask, is there any cure for allergy? Because, you know, like if you, if you go, if you need to go through that symptom two times a year, you want to do something to get rid of from your body. But my home doctor told me that once your body develops allergy, there is no, you need to live your life with that allergy. Allergy is a part of it. And when I took him, when I saw that my allergy has been disappeared, to me, it was a really miracle. I didn't have any expectation because of how I got introduced to to me. I mean, it wasn't good impression. So I didn't have any expectation on him, him but I got this amazing result. That's what it was an eye opener for me. That's why I started researching for the carry. So what did hemoin did to me? When I have an allergic reaction, what it mean? Something coming into, into my body, some substance coming into my body, my immune system is overreacting it. 
that's why because of that, I'm getting those reactions of, you know, um, runny nose, each eyes, body aches. But by taking him on what it does, it kind of calm it down. Okay, your immune system t- kicking too much. Okay, let's calm it down. So we also hear, um, hear testimony from people who have a high cholesterol, low cholesterol, people with a diabetes with, who need to check out sugar levels. Because of the modulation, it helps to average out, right? If it's too low, pull it up. If it's too high, so not only boosting immune system, it also helps to modulate it. So person who has an allergy, which means um, when the person is taking celery, the body is reacting to it. So by taking hemoim, I cannot say that it will help right away, but by taking consistently, it will, um, it will help. You will be able to help. But I don't think that because of that person cannot take hemoim, no, I think there's no relations to it. Okay. Um, I have a many ladies who has allergy to chicken. Surprisingly, I know many ladies who has who, um, who has allergy to chicken and they want to eat Zolibi, I mean Jolibi chicken. So they say that before, before eating chicken, they are taking him on him. And now they can enjoy. So we're we are hearing from you know live testimony from the people who actually have an allergy and how hemohim really helping them in their daily lives. Thank you, Ari. Um, Ari, uh, we got one question from uh, Aida. So can we recommend it to a person with pacemaker? So pacemaker, this is a device that is implanted in the skin to yeah. help uh, regulate with the heartbeat. So can we recommend it with this? Um, I had a one member, it, it was a partner who had it. He was still taking it. So as, as I mentioned, I don't really have a medical license, so I cannot really explain in a medical terms, but I can explain or I can share based on the stories or testimony, which I have heard it from my partner. So I actually, I did have a partner who had a pacemaker and then he was taking two a day. Was there no reaction? Is, was it... I mean, is he feeling normal after taking it? Yes, that? yes. So when he started taking it, he said, I mean, he couldn't really breathe properly. Of course, it was one of the healing crises for him. But he is also a nurse. So he knows that his body is reacting to the new substance coming into this, his body. So he was aware of it. So he didn't panic. So he said um, it took like three days for it to normalize it. All right, thank you. And we got one comment here um, from Anna. So her husband have diabetes. When he tried him or him, his blood sugar spikes. The doctor scolded him because the result of the blood test becomes higher than before when he was taking him or him. So what do you think is the reason behind? It's a part of a healing crisis too. So even when you ask, because we know we have a several doctors, even in Korea, there are doctors who, do, who are doing atomy. The physicians, the doctors, the licensed doctors, they are sharing him with So why do you think they're sharing him with Because they even figure it out after their researches. There is nothing wrong with him or him. So yes, um, it's not only time I'm hearing it. I also have a, um, like many members. Oh, Eric, you told me that it's good for the cholesterol. It's good for this. I, I took it. And when I went to see a doctor, my doctor like told me, whatever you are taking it, stop taking it. But once you once a person has a reaction, what, I, what we usually suggested, okay, how many shashir are you taking it? So if the person says, I'm taking two a day, we usually, I usually suggest it. I'm just reduced to one per day for now. And let's see how your body reacts to it. And then once your once you or test that comes back normal, you can increase to two. But don't stop taking him away. So for them, um, you know, the graph spiking up or like dropped a little bit more, it's part of all healing crisis. It's, it's a really, I know, part, for the person who has an illness, for the, for the person who has a problem, yes, it's a scary moment. But we have heard from so many stories from the people who's been taking continuously. They all went through it. Right. Thank you, Ari. So we got some more questions here. I hope this is fine for you, Ari. So um, next question. What makes him different from other immune system supplements? Uh, what makes him different from water? As I mentioned, this is man-made. And we're talking about the carry technology level. As I mentioned, the, the, the old gentleman who's been working in a pharmaceutical company for 30 years, he doesn't believe any of the, 
the medicine can be better because he already know the system, how the you know, supplement or how the medicine can be manufactured in a pharmaceutical company. But I'm talking about, but as soon as I talk about the technology, which they can create a space food, he said, this product cannot be compared with any of the product manufactured by the pharmaceutical, pharmaceutical companies. And especially Canada, um, even people in USA, they praise to get a supplement from him or him because him um, can, um, sorry, even people in USA, they wanted to get a supplement from Canada because Canada is very strict and they do have amazing pharmaceutical companies in Canada. So even people in USA, they wanted to get a supplement, but even he said, Hemoim is better than any supplement you will see on the market because of the technology level. Even Canada doesn't have a technology level to make a space food. So even, like, many people, because Eric, when I go to an um, organic store, I can see something for immune boosting this and that, but I usually mention, okay, uh, maybe you're not going to trust me, but just go and Google carry. It made from that technology. All right. Thank you, Eri. And um, the next question is, can mothers who do breastfeeding and they chemo him do? I guess not. Am I correct? I mean, yes, you can. You can. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. Um, I, I took him home and I breast my second daughter because when I was pregnant with my first daughter, I didn't know him or him, but I get, I gave birth to my second daughter on 2013, November. And that's when I started taking him or him. All right, we'll, and we'll, I was breastfeeding for six months. So baby will be healthier. Okay. So there is not, uh, there, there will be no effect on the baby's development, right? Because we all know that baby babies are still developing. Yes. Um, yes. Yeah, so even that one, I cannot say yes or no. It's really depend or it's a choice of the mother. I yes. believe in him or him. That's why I had no problem taking it and, you know, giving that breast milk to my daughter. I had no problem with it. Yeah. Because with pregnant women, it's not allowed to take him or him, right? Um, even for that, I'll just share from the experiences. Okay, so if the mother, um, if the woman has been taking him or him even before getting pregnant, so her body is used to him or him, then most of the people that I know here in Canada, they continuously taking even during their pregnancy. And they gave birth. But for the people who never got introduced to him or him, uh, what we are suggesting, okay, so we don't want, we don't want any, any blame if any, um, anything goes wrong, but you can start taking him or him after like five months because that's a time that we know that baby's stable. So we can say like after five months. Five months, okay, thank you. But most of the ladies who has been taking even before conceiving a baby, they can continue it. I've, mm -hmm. I've seen it several ladies Several ladies um, who's been doing acne for six years, and now they gave birth. They got pregnant last year, which means they've been taking him for six years. And while they're pregnant with a newborn, and then they were still continuously taking him away, and then they gave birth. Perfect. Thank you, Ari. So we got here last two questions. You mentioned a while ago that Kimu him was tested with Korea, Korea Cancer Hospital. Yes. Were there some patients that got healed from cancer by taking him or him? Or so, what I can explain by, by that is it will help, as I mentioned, it will help to reduce the symptoms of the person when they go through the radiation therapy or chemotherapy. And when they see the side effect reduced dramatically, they figure it out it can be beneficial to many of the people actually we have a great testimony from one of our um, not our group um, one of our leader in atony overall um, i believe like now they are crown master she, she was a cancer survivor so she got a um, stage of three rare form of breast cancer and she was she was in the unit where where all the all the ladies who got breast cancer in a rare form of breast cancer, she was isolated in a, a special unit. And she said um, there were eight, there were eight ladies except her all passed away. She was the only survivor. And that experience made her, okay, she wasn't, she wasn't thinking of creating an income with asthma, but she just wanted to share the miracle of this amazing food supplement. 
And amazing thing, because as we all know, once, once a person, once a lady go through the radiation therapy or chemotherapy, or they suffer from a cancer, they won't be able to conceive a baby anymore. But after that, she gave birth two more times. So Amazing. if you if you ask, okay, how is it how is it gonna be work scientifically? Nobody will be able to answer in detail. I think even doctors won't be able to answer in detail. I think hemohim will work differently to some people, but we do have many cancer survivors in atomy leaders. They are leaders who actually had a cancer, but with hemohim, they actually saw a benefit and they actually experienced get rid of cancer. Perfect. Thank you very much, Ari. So last question, um, Ari, I, I, I believe that this is also part of the healing crisis. So there was one member who tried him with him and she suddenly felt so warm. So could you confirm or could you share that this is also yeah. part of the healing crisis? I mean, it, but is it always or just to, um, just for that first time, um, first time? Um, she doesn't even say, but uh, it warm? It's, 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 uh, yes, because basically, um, this is the information we actually heard it from. This is from like Royal Master Namili in Canada, and then she really knows a lot about Hemohim and she knows a lot of story. When you we take a Hemohim, you know, it's some kids, um, you know, some of the ladies who cannot really conceive, and we have a stories where they were able to get pregnant after taking Hemohim. Hemohim, by taking Hemohim, it will increase the body temperature, it makes our body warmer. So if the person is really sensitive, they will might they might feel like why why am I so hot all of a sudden? Because that's because uh, that's how I felt personally. I didn't have any healing crisis or I didn't have any discomfort with the hemohim. But that's one thing that's personally I experienced. Oh, when I take a hemohim, I'm, I'm kind of feel warmer. All right. Thank you very much, Ari. So, Ari, sorry, super, super duper last question. So, there's one member who's asking is uh, if it's okay to take chemo him together with others, other supplements like vitamin C, fish oil, Definitely. and so on. Definitely. Even with other medication, this is, this is where many people get confused. Okay, I'm taking, like, as I mentioned, I, I know many people who are taking like, you know, um, medication, not a supplement. We're talking about medication. Oh, I'm taking, you know, cholesterol pills. I'm taking diabetes pills. I'm taking pills. Is it okay for me to include hemohim? The answer is yes. Okay, yes. Uh, I believe so because this is, oh, the uh, hemohim is a food Natural supplement. Natural supplement? Yeah. Yes, it's a supplement. So yeah, people usually, I can really tell them, you know what, you don't need to worry. You don't even have to ask. Sometimes, sometimes I tell them. You don't need to worry because you know how many years I've been sharing, I've been seeing people getting better. And we have a great testimony from one of our new uh, new diamond master. I believe like she's 73. She said she almost died last year with, with a certain failure in her in her organ. And then she almost died, but Hemohim survived her. And she was taking a lot of medication, but with Hemohim, she will, now she she was able to reduce some of them. So that's a story we are hearing from many of the seniors who are taking a lot of medication. Perfect. Thank you very much, Eri. So I myself, I'm taking food supplements like fish oil, uh, pomegranate fruit jelly, vitamin C, probiotics. Plus, I'm also taking a lifetime medicine because I was operated with total thyroidectomy. So in order for my hormones to be balanced, I am taking this medicine lifetime.